What is going on everyone? Welcome back to another Ball Carter video. We are on part nine of our case of 2024 Tops Update Blaster Boxes. Um, yeah, so this is boxes 33 through 36. Uh, we're nearing the end. Um, I got to admit to, I kind of, these are all pre-recorded and I got done with uh, part eight about a half hour, hour ago. And oh my God, if you, if you guys are watching nine right now and you haven't seen part eight, oh my God, you have to watch it. I've never had an opening like that in my life. I've had some openings that are pretty crazy, but like that one was nuts. The sheer, <laughs> the sheer amount of rare hits was absolutely in the names. Let's just say I hit somebody, somebody massive in a gold. Let's say I hit a one of one. Let's say I hit a, a black bordered black gold parallel of a massive rookie. Let's also say I had a ton of Halloweens of massive rookie names, all in four boxes. That was crazy. Uh, sorry, anyway, sorry. If you haven't seen that yet, you guys gotta watch that. That was nuts, that was fun. Um, yeah, thanks for joining me though. Go ahead, like, comment if you'd, li uh, if you'd like, uh, subscribe if you guys like this content. Um, also, we're doing a, a free a giveaway of Tops Update Hanger Box 2024. Uh, all you gotta do is like and comment on three of the 10 videos that we're doing here in the series and make sure you're subscribed and have a public account so I know you're subscribed. But uh, yeah, I'm still like, I don't know, that was crazy. I'm not gonna give away because I want you to watch the video. <laughs> and uh, you have to comment on which card do you think is the best one? Because there's multiple. And I don't know. I don't know. That was crazy. I also got to say, too, I'm watching the Yankee Dodger game right now. So whenever this video releases, this is game four. And just watched Volpe hit a grand slam to go up 5-2. I have no idea what's going to happen. You know, when you watch this video, it's going to be in, in the future. And, but at least as Yankee fans, we had a moment. Um... That was crazy fun. So it's been a really crazy uh, last last hour here tonight. <laughs> man. Man. I still can't get over that. Ooh. We got a Halloween of uh, this is one of the Otani card here. It is. Nice. That's collectible. That's a sweet card right there. Let's leave that up. The whole case we've been going where we've been hitting tons of parallels, but just no names at all. No big names. And I was just thinking, we're going to eventually go on a run where it just it just is nuts. And that's exactly what happened. John Singleton on the purple. And Willie Mays. I've been hitting a lot of these lately. These were so rare in the first case, or the first half of the case. And now I'm hitting them like crazy this half. So, like, I'm starting to question how rare of an insert it actually is. I think it's one of the more rare ones, but. Um, by the way, of the, gosh, the 1989 parallels, I only, I only have four cards left to complete the set of that. I definitely have tons of sets of the MLB, Stars MLB, I probably have four or five. Um, but I need four more. I don't know which ones they are, but I know the numbers that I need, but nice rookie. Ooh, Jackson Holiday. That's a good chrome right there. Stars in will be chrome. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve that up. That's a sweet one. So, hit some good parallels. The par parallels are finally good names here, guys. Finally hitting some good names. I'm, I'm waiting for... Wait for a low-numbered Halloween, like the bats. I really want one of the bats... Uh, Parallels. Those are really cool. Okay. The only thing I was disappointing about that opening is I hit so many good Halloween parallel name with you know good rookie names, but none of them none of them were jack o' lanterns. I was like, man, of all of them, and the one like the one box, the one guy that I didn't know who he was, that was the jack o' lantern. Uh, whoops, wrong pile there. Uh, nice Seth Lugo. It's a good pitcher. For the Royals. Got Matt Olson on Mystical and a nice Shohei. 
on the All Star. All Stars, I'm a little further away from completing that set. That one's a little harder to complete. Which is why when you hit a, a good All Star, like rookie card, I mean, they're, they're rare cards. You don't hit those very much. That's why I always think they should be more valuable than they are, because they really don't hold a ton of value from the All Star inserts, but I personally like them. Did a black, black uh, parallel to 299 of Corbin Carroll, rookie All Star last year, and that thing did not sell well at all. Got it great as PSA 10, and I think we eventually sold it for like 50 bucks, but man, people just don't. I don't know. The All Star rookie card is just not. It's not collectible in the hobby, I guess. Paul Urban on the Halloween. See, I'm hitting these these inserts like crazy. I keep wondering if I'm hitting a parallel and I just don't know it either. So let me know if uh, that happens. Juan Soto there. Man, I am struggling with these packs. Like the one corner just does not, does not want to open. Got some hanger boxes coming. They should come tomorrow, although I feel like something said that, ooh, ooh, we got a nice combo here coming up. I got an email saying that it might not be till Thursday, which stinks. Ooh, there we go, nice Suzuki Minaga. That's cool, I love I love these combo cards. Um, if there are players I like, I definitely think they're collectible. Like, I like the, the Soto and Judge one. We got a green. Rangers, Michael Lorenzen. Langford would have been a really good one there. Tops Chrome on the Cruz. All right, moving on. Okay. When I do the hanger boxes, those should be easier to open. <laughs> uh, just have to open it once and get a ton of cards. I'm failing at opening these. All right, we got a blue parallel coming up. Nice rookie, Joey Estes. There's that. Woods Richardson and a Manny Machado on the Mystical. I got some good Mysticals. Still love that parallel. That and the Black Golds, by far the best. I gotta be careful if I. Uh, Careful with those edges, opening up in case you hit something huge like I did in the last video. Robert Suarez. I feel like this could be a jack o' lantern. Nope. Get a lot of Halloween parallels. I feel like we've hit, what, seven and two boxes? I'm not sure which one had the extra, but. All right. Box number three. Doing okay. Not as much fire in this opening, but you know what? I had a lot of fire in the uh, in the previous one, so. Schemes. So you're kind of back to like, not hitting the names again. I kind of wish it spread out a little bit more, so they're not all the same. We got a nice Chapman coming up. Uh, I dropped it, but it's okay. It's just Chapman. We got a uh, rookie, blue, Red Sox. Ah, that'd be like Rafael or something. That'd be a good one. And nice Ronald Acuna on the Mystical. I'm going to say we've gotten the inserts a lot better in the second half of the case. First half of the case, I don't know, seemed a little sparse on the the good inserts, the ones that I like. We have not hit a jack lantern in a while. We haven't hit a ghost in a while. I feel like we're due. I've hit this card a lot in this opening. Nothing really stand worthy here lately. Nothing really worth putting up on the stand, which is fine, but 
We've got a backwards number. Let's go the rainbow foil. Uh, veteran combos. Yamamoto and Shohei. There we go. That's a nice hit. I'm telling you, the combos are cool. The combos are cool. And that, people like Otani. I'll take it. Actually, let's put that in the middle. It's a cool card. Victor Scott, the second. Got a nice retail blue of him in the last. There we go. That's a nice one. I like that one right there. He's a decent hit. And then we got a blue uh, veteran combos, rookie combos. Ah, rookie combos. No. I wanted that in the veterans. So that is, yep, to $9.99. Those veterans, then we at least know who they are. Jeter. That there, I guess. Abrams. Forgot CJ Abrams made the All Star game. Yeah, I totally, totally forgot that one. All right, this box, like these boxes, this video have been pretty decent. This is probably about like an average. Um, and then. Sorry, I had to adjust, adjust the chair here a little bit. It's like I was scrunching my knee there. All right, last box. All right, can we go back to hitting some big ones again? Robbie Ray. Ooh, we got an orange. Ooh, we got our jack o' lantern finally. Robbie Ray. Why can't it be a rookie? But we do have an orange, so this is a this is a good box right here, right off the bat. Diamondbacks, Eugenio, Eugenio Suarez. Man, I don't know how to say that name. Hey, it's an orange. And we got a blue retail blue. Wow, what a loaded. Man, that could have been three massive names all in a row. It wasn't, but it could have been. <laughs> now I'm like thinking, is there anything left in this box? Because we hit nice low numbered orange. Retail blue already, and the jack o' lantern. <laughs> I want to get at least one more ghost. Veteran combos, Blake Snell and Patrick Bailey. That's not bad. That's a good one. Patrick Bailey's pretty good. Pretty good catcher. A few packs to go. Haven't hit a ton of schemes on the base rookies. I've hit a ton of his debuts, just not, haven't hit the collation of his true rookie. I think we have like maybe five, but we should have more. Justin Topa. Rainbow foil. All right. Yariel Rodriguez. It's a rookie. A lot of rookie pitchers in this set. Jung Ho Lee on the Mystical. I love these cards. I'm trying to, I think that's an Eagle right there. Eagle. You got a Tiger. Panda. There's something in the background here. I can't quite tell. Uh, I'll try to find that out later. Kind of a unique card. <laughs> All right, last pack here. Last pack of the video. Part nine, Joey Bart, Pirates, it's weird, and that's it for this video, so not not a phenomenal opening, but we did get some nice, uh, some veteran combo cards, some, some good name parallels, we got a jack-o'-lantern in there, uh, we did get, we had some good number parallels, just not the names, I mean, we got this orange, we got this blue, rookie combos, plenty of retail blues. We did hit a green. So, man, we, we hit the number cards well. And, oh, and a purple. So we hit four four number cards. That was that was good. That was a good run there. Um, we got a nice Topps Chrome, Jackson Holiday. We got a nice uh, Suzuki and Imanaga. Nice rainbow foil. 
Japanese star hits LA and then nice Otani. That's a good one. That's actually really good. But that's all I got for this video, guys. Please give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, comment, like, and comment on three. You guys get a chance to win a hanger box, free Tops Update hanger box. Um, yeah, make sure you're subscribed. But uh, we'll see you guys in the last video. We got part 10 coming up, and then we'll do a recap after that too. So, all right, thanks for joining me.